Esports is the gathering of organized competitive video gaming. A lot of people think of, you know, when they hear the word video games, they think of, you know, Super Mario, Mario Kart, maybe Candy Crush on their phone. But competitive esports is a, a bunch of games that high level competition, you know, the best out of 20 million players in the world play for millions or millions upon millions of dollar prize pools. And it's pitting essentially the best against the best. Bethany started eSports because we have a world-class broadcasting program, and we also have an alumni, Eric Longquist, uh, who's known in the gaming world as Doa. He's uh, the Al Michaels of eSports. He has the most famous uh, broadcast or call of eSports plays in the history of eSports. It's a League of Legends play. It's the Faker Ryu Z Al play. To the bed. Oh, Faker may be in trouble here. Death Mark tries to clean it up for Ryu. Oh, look at the cleanse, look at the moves. Faker, what was that? This was something that we knew with the people that we have as a staff, um, we knew that this was something we could do and we, can do it, we could do it really well. And so as we explored that idea, uh, we knew we had the right pieces in place here already with, with how it works, how it can work and how we can be really good at it. So it was kind of getting all the right people together in the room and just say, is this something we can do? And it was a resounding yes. If you look at the things that we do well, when, when you say a, a, an institution's name, you kind of are associating with what they do really well. I think for us, when people say Bethany, they, they're thinking of our media program and the stuff that we do in all things media. And those teams are gonna need shoutcasters, people to hold cameras, right? People to run cable. They're gonna need players, you know? And that, that's just a small sample of when you get out and, and what the future's bringing. A new avenue to get into potential jobs such as, you know, the broadcasting, the social media, the marketing, you know, you name it. Any major now has another avenue or another career path. It's really exciting to know that we're in that space and we think that that's an, an exclusive market right now because not a lot of colleges are doing that. So it allows our students to find footing, find passion in a new new area for production that there's definitely a need for it. The other half of that is it's, it's a whole new group of students to campus. There's always been gamers on campus, that's no surprise. But what's really cool is that now you have guys who take it ultra seriously, like this is their passion. Many of the guys' dreams are to play professional video games on a huge stage in front of tens of thousands of fans. Esports on television is one of the only growing television events in viewership. When it comes to esports, it's more watched than Netflix, ESPN, and HBO combined. And that's impressive. And so you know that the market growth, one, has shot up the last number of years, and it's going to get even more so. Spending some time and making sure that you have the right plan that allows you to get the next five years right with your future planning, uh, because these things all adapt, they all change. There's different. There's gonna be different games in three to five years. What do those look like? What do those needs look like? We're gonna wanna push it to the top level. We, anything that we've done and been involved with from a broadcasting perspective, we're gonna wanna make sure we're doing it at a top level that no one else is doing. Uh, so far we have this one room. We had 30 students sign up for eSports for this, this fall. We got the best start we could possibly ask for within our first year from getting a uh, League of Legends team up and running that is one of the best teams in the nation. The dream is to have all games that are really relevant have the top level players in each of those games at Bethany. We want to be a top level school in every single game that is either out right now or will come out in the future. As far as the future goes, we're looking to expand um, and accommodate as many students for esports as we possibly can. We look at it, we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it right. Esports isn't going anywhere. It's not a 10-year fad. It's something here to stay. So it, it's the next big thing.